Magdalena Fresh. <laughs> Magdalena Freck, my favorite tennis player from Poland. I think she's amazing. She will play anywhere there's a tennis court. Don't believe me? Check her schedule last year. Amazing. She is always in shape. I think she's a great shot maker as well. But she's struggling here to stay alive in this match. She needs to hold serve and break back. And that's just to extend the second set. She'll still have to win the second set to force a third. But regardless what happens in this match, you have to be proud of what she's accomplished. She's ranked 88th on tour. She has an automatic qualification for Wimbledon in the U.S. Open. That's going to be amazing. After a tough earlier part of the year qualifying at the Indian Wells in Miami, getting the lucky loser spots, now she's on the up and up, baby. 17 and 15. She's having a winning season. 10 and 4 on clay. She's won 7 of her last 10. We saw wins over Chloe Paquette from France, and we saw wins over Jasmine Polini. However, the problem here is the second serve. Camilla Rakimova is winning 43% of her second serves, and that's the, that's the issue. That's led to six breakpoint opportunities where Camilla's cash in on four. Can she do it? It's going to be a huge mountain to climb. Camilla Rakimova, look, we saw her take out Alicia Parks. She's having a pretty darn good season, to be honest with you. She's won six out of ten. She's beating some really good competition. We saw her beat Arango and Russ, two good clay players. Now, Magdalena, in my opinion, does have to work on the first serve a little bit. Uh, she's only winning 53% of her first serves, while Camilla Rakimova is winning 72%. Magdalena is going to have one last chance to break back and extend this match. Can she do it? Well, right now, she wins the first point. That's a big sigh of relief. That's a great start. Come on, Magdalena. You can do it.